Again, welcome back to Darkwood. Feels a little bit like a deja vu, but this is chapter two. This is the swamp, and I think it's now day 13. Day 12 did not go well. Or it didn't end well, at the very least. I, uh, I died again. I didn't even make it back here. That's the first time that's happened. Fuck the radio tower. Fuck Banshees. Fuck that... Yeah, fuck the Northeast, basically. I don't really want to go back there. I probably will have to go back there because it seems like that's an important area. I mean, why would there be so many banshees? It can't just be shiny stones there, right? They've got to be protecting something else. But I don't want to go back there right now. Definitely not. Definitely not now. I know where the holes are. I know I can get to those holes. I will probably try and go around the Great Lake and end up at this cottage that I should be going to. So, yeah. That's pretty much what I'm going for. Hopefully it's going to be easier. Hopefully I don't run into anything. And, uh, yeah. As, as well as the fucking radio tells- Fuck these things! I don't understand you! Why didn't you let me out? Asshole. Anyway, yeah, let's jump back into the hole. And, yeah, we're going, uh, northwest, I guess. No weird centipede man thing? Not this time. Okay. Right. Yeah. It's a real tragedy, dying. No reputation with the traders. Didn't really have too much reputation with them to begin with, but I did manage to sell the fabric that I had. What was that? Wait, whoa! Jesus Christ! Oh God, we got a mushroom man already! You explode, right? Explode quicker, please! There you go. Oh wow, look at that. <laughs> look at that square of blood you've created. Alright, let's uh, grab the odd meat. Was that a- Oh, there's a swamper here. Fuck the Great Lake too. Fuck the swamp, man. Everything. And I think I do mean everything is here to kill me, or block me in so that I can get killed. I'm not a fan. Oh, man. Okay, so this is still the, the same lake, I take it? Yeah, wow. Uh, what happened to you? Oh, okay. Shall I have a look? Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh. Okay, great. Fancy running into you. Oh, what's this stuff? Okay. Why would I burn that away? Is there something underneath it? Or... Something around here? I'm curious now. Probably shouldn't be. There's something around here. That could be one of the crates that needs a lockpick. Yeah, okay. I don't... Wait, really? Oh, that must be so... Oh, I think that's probably a couple of the items that I lost when I died. That's really annoying. Fuck. This game, man. It's good, but oh my god, is it annoying sometimes, especially when you die. Right. I did put away my lantern and military flashlight. I've kept the normal flashlight with me. Might need to use it. It seems to be kind of dark around here. Where are we now? Still around the Great Lake. Wow. You going this way? Up there? Let's just keep going north. I do want to get to the cottage. Oh wait, I just realized that I have a fucking... Oh god damn! <laughs> it's too many things! Fuck you. There you go, you are. So I just realized they don't have a clock up here. I think I must have dropped that as well. This is so annoying. <sighs> That's going to turn into a spider thing, isn't it? I would, I would assume so. So let's avoid that, like the plague. And that seems like bait to me. And I don't want to fall for it. Is this the- oh, here we are! We're at- we're at the cottage, apparently, or we're very close to it. Somewhere around here? Could be. Could be. Right, yeah, it does seem to be really quite dark, so... There you go. Some mushrooms, I suppose. What's the catch? No traps? What the fuck is... Oh, sorry. Who the fuck is that? Is that... That's the Doctor! He's actually got antlers now! 
Look at this guy! What? Warm? A chunk of mud falls down on his exposed tongue. He chews it slowly and swallows with satisfaction. He's eating soil and mud now, is he? <laughs> okay. I don't know if we're going to get any interesting gossip out of him, but let's try. The doctor puts the muddy hand into his mouth, grimaces, and pulls out a yellow tooth. He puts it into the pocket of his torn trousers. The tooth falls through a hole. He does not notice this. Really, wow. He's more tree than man now, I think. Anything else? Oh boy. At some point, I'm going to have to put him out of his misery, I think. Soon. Very soon. Not long from now. This is creepy. The doctor glances at me. He tilts his head sideways, lost in thought. After a moment, he extends his hand towards me as if wanting to grab me by the throat, but stops halfway. He freezes. Slowly, he bends down and grabs a thick branch from the ground. He starts biting the bark off of it. He swallows the bark with an effort, but also great satisfaction. He places the stick among other ones sticking out of his mud-covered head. Right. So that's how they get their style. Right, so it's not really antlers, but... Anything to trade? Oh yeah, okay! Well, again, a choice of three, and again, some free 100 reputation. That's great, I suppose. Uh, I mean, I guess I could probably get the embryo. I don't know. Uh, I don't know if I wanted to meddle with the mushrooms, because I know there's just going to be more negative perks, and the positives, are they really positives? I don't know. I'll, I'll get a long barrel. That will sell for like 225. And again, nothing to show him. Okay. All right. Yeah, maybe uh, maybe next time I see you, I'll put a bullet through your head. What are you doing here anyway? Very weird. All right, let's grab those mushrooms. Might as well. What? Is that it? <laughs> hoo, 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 hoo. Is that a... That's a snail, right? These are snail humans. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. Oh, God, they're all over the place. Look at the size of some of them, though. Wow. Is this... We're still on the... Right, we're still near the cottage, I guess. Cut me loose. I don't know. Can I? I don't think so. You've joined now. That's a big one. <laughs> right. Yeah, you know what? Maybe I, maybe I want to get the axe out. <laughs> or the gun. The gun, maybe. Alright. Um, that must be the cottage, right? So this has got something to do with the compressor parts. What have we got here? Okay, well, we've got a note. I've got a note. Okay. Uh, oh, it's a little map. Bear trap, useful scrap metal, gun parts, da 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 okay. These are all marked on the map, are they? Alright. Uh, oh, hang on, uh, F, scrap metal, an old compressor. There's F. There. What is this a map of? Is this where, this might be where I am right, right now. Like, snail country, I don't know. But somewhere, yeah, if I follow the map, I suppose, and try and head for F, that's where I'm going to find an old compressor and get the parts for it, I guess. Uh, yeah, let's grab the rest of it. More wood? Sure, sure. <laughs> really? Can I just walk around? <laughs> Wait, an organic cord. Some kind of organic cords. They're slowly pulsating. They're surprisingly hard and durable. It's, it's like, it's, it's the vein and blood network of the forest. This is crazy. <laughs> it's like this has been completely flattened by that giant shell. Nowhere else to go? No? Okay. 
Could I? Oh, no, there you go. It's telling me the shell is cracked. Maybe I could break it open. Yeah, maybe I could. God damn. Oh, wow, that really fucking hurt my durability, but okay. Oh, my God. That's a hand. Looks like a human hand, but it's sticky and grown into the shell. A key grows out of the palm. Right. The shed key. I got a, I got a shed key. Great. Wait, hang on, hang on. Hold on. Is it the key for, for this door up here? I'm hoping it's not, because there is one room in the hideout that is locked. And I'm wondering if it's for that one. Ah, oh, shit, it's for this shed. Damn, I guess that makes sense, but... Oh, that's kind of pointless, isn't it? I suppose we can just, like, walk in. There isn't, like, a normal door. Can we go in through the... No, we can't go in through that way either. Wow. Uh, yeah. I think we're kind of done here. But we do have that map. Did I add that to the journal? Like, is there an entry about it? Still nothing. But still, it must be in items, right? Uh, note? Yes. So I guess there's an area of the swamp that looks a little bit like this. And then I need to find F. Is it the right orientation? Is it north at the top, south at the bottom? And these shaded areas, are they rocks? Water? Right, well, uh, we got we got to search somewhere, I guess. What's that? Oh, that's... Oh, that's the junkyard. Oh, okay, I guess I was kind of close to that. Uh, yeah. I guess we could go there next, or maybe southwest. We need to find what's on this map. And it's... It's actually kind of unnerving not having the time anymore. I should be used to this, but I, I, I don't know how much time i got left. I want to know when I have to run back to the hole, really. Right, this way? Let's just go this way. More water, yeah. Not if I can help it. <laughs> Although maybe, yeah, maybe... Oh, maybe it's the Great Lake? Maybe that's what the map's of? Look at all those mushrooms. They're so tempting. Nah, I'm not gonna fall for it. Not me. Uh, okay. So the, the junkyard, alright. Uh, squeeze through here. Oh god, what's that? Oh, it's a human spider thing! Oh god, right. What the fuck? Yeah, I'll grab that, why not? What have we got here then? Is that E? Or M, maybe? Oh, really? Really? Is this the place? It's the junkyard? Let's have a look at the journal again. Where is E? Is that it? That could be the E. So maybe if I go northeast of this, I'll find F? I don't know. Let's see. What have we got here anyway? Oh, right. Oh, you need- oh, you need a shovel! Oh, right, so we're digging through trash? Let's see, though. Is- is that another trash heap to dig through? It is. Again, yeah, I'll need the shovel, but that might be where I find the compressor parts, to be honest. Can you go around here? No. It's just that I, I think I see something that looks a little bit like the compressor there. Never mind. Anyway, I think I found it. I think this is F. Oh, really? Yeah. I want to avoid the water and you start fucking raining. Great. What the hell's it? No! No! Oh, shit! Okay, I've got another watch, yay! But... No. This isn't who I think it is, is it? Here, Trek, man. I'm surprised you got this far, but... 
fuck. I see the corpse there. With... <laughs> okay. Let's drop that. Probably should have taken, actually. Fuck. Alright, that is... That's actually saddened me. And there's C over there. Jesus Christ. I don't know how far away the swamp is from the old area, but... I, I don't know. I'm flabbergasted to deal that far, but shit. The trader, now peer track. This is ruthless, this game. Everyone's dying, even me. And there continues to be more mushrooms. And what's this? A. What's meant to be an A? A bear trap, many nails and planks. Well, that's kind of useful, I suppose. And that's A. Yeah, you can just sort of see the A there. Looks like a, a pointer, but... Ah, oh, crap. Anyway. What do I do? Do I go back and grab the shovel? Start digging? I probably should, right? Yeah, almost certainly. Alright, we're out of the junkyard now, I think. I am going to go back to the hideout. I don't think I'll have enough time to come back here, but tomorrow I'll bring a shovel and we will dig up the compressor parts and, and see what happens when we fix that. Right now... Oh, is this the mushroom glade again? Yeah, we're here. I should know this, or some of it. Not this bit specifically. Uh, don't want to get lost. Right, I think if I just head south, I can end up where I was before. I think I remember seeing this, actually. Let's just cross over. Yeah, I remember seeing that. Okay, so I, I know where I am, more or less. <laughs> and I know there's something in the water still. This area, man. This fucking area. Come on. I... Oh, really? I... <laughs> I still don't want to tempt a swamper to come out. So I'm still avoiding it. Down here? No? Oh, shit. Are we getting closer to home? I guess we must be around there. I should be able to run across that, right? Oh, I don't need to. Cool. Yeah. I remember coming up here. Because I heard that noise over there. Maybe I'll find out what that noise is someday. But not today. Ah, oh, shit. That's right. Over here. Okay, cool, cool. And... I hope to see a hole. Oh, no. Holes up there. Well, okay, we're back. We're back, and I don't want to... I don't want to run around anymore. I think I'm just going to stay here and survive the night. So let's just dump what we can off at the workbench. Uh, we don't have enough wire for the upgrade, do we? No, we need one more. Just one more. Don't need that many. Let's use that odd meat before it runs out. I don't even know if I want to, but I've got it, so... Go on. Oh. It's not going to be good, is it? Well, I don't know. We're in the, uh, I guess, the top tier of upgrades, so we get to choose from Adrenaline, deal double damage in melee when close to death, which does seem pretty good. My vitality will increase, just in general, I suppose. And there's Chameleon, where once a day I'll be able to become invisible to enemies if I stay still. Right, okay. So that'll be another perk, much like Scream. And I know now that you can't use two at once, which is really annoying. Anyway, what's the negative? My accuracy will decrease, okay. 
and healing items will be less effective. How important is accuracy, really? Because if there's something attacking me, it's usually right next to me. And I, you know, I don't have a sniper. I mean, I've got a hunting rifle, I suppose. Healing items will be less effective. I don't like the sound of that. I might get shaky hands. I might. And that really shouldn't affect my meleeing, right? So, yeah, let's get that, because, you, you know, you've got to choose one or the other, right? Yeah. And the positive... See, Chameleon does sound fun. Maybe let's just increase my vitality, just a little bit. I mean, is that health and stamina? Is it the combo? Let's find out. That's it. 16,000 now. Okay, so there's no vision. No weird fever dreams. Uh, I guess not. No, I guess at this point I'm just sort of used to the mushrooms. That's a terrifying thought. Um, yeah, okay, so back to this. So I want to grab those, I suppose. Uh, oh, right, yeah, okay. Um, anything else I want to take with me? Probably, I'd take that tomorrow, of course. Um, do I want to put the exploding barrel down? Probably not. I don't know. I don't want to push my luck. I just want to survive. Surviving tonight will be a victory. Hmm. Yeah, okay. Alright. I mean... That should be enough. I hope. I guess we'll see, won't we? So I don't think repairing this doorway is worth it, but I would like to repair some things around this sort of area. So... That's barricaded and should be on full health. Nothing's attacked it yet. Same with that. Shall I, um... I guess let's repair the doorway. And that can be like a second protection. That can be a second barricade. So yeah, there you go. Um... I've got a barrel there that if someone comes in, I guess I could shoot. Maybe. I mean, how, how accurate is this, really? Uh, he's, I guess the accuracy is the same, but it takes a lot longer to get as accurate. I guess that's what Shaky Hands does. Do I repair this? I don't know if it's worth it. I'd rather give them all free roam, providing they don't come in here. That's my biggest fear. Tell you what, let's just make a couple of, uh, of bear traps. There you go. And... Is it enough? I think five is enough, yeah. I think I want to say it's nine. I want to say it's nine. Oh, it's seven. Okay, it's not. Okay, sure. Well, um, I think, yeah, I think we're ready to go. Let's turn this on. Got the light in there, just in case something does actually pop its head in. Um, how do I want to play this, though? I know. I think. No. Nope. Keep making that mistake. Keep trying to drag and drop things. It just doesn't work that way. Yeah, let's put let's put one here. So if anything does try and bash down the door, it's you know it's going to get caught. I'll close that. Barricade up. And I don't know where to put the other bear trap, but I'm thinking near one of the windows. This seems to be pretty okay at the moment. I guess if I if I hear something trying to bash its way in, yeah, I'll uh, I'll drop it on the other side of the window. And I guess I could just leave that here for the meantime. Nah, I'll keep it on me. I'll keep it on me. Okay, so. There you go. 
Uh, yeah. Is it worth healing? Probably not. Okay, let's see if we can survive the night. I'm ready. Bring it the fuck on. So there's lights on over there, but not really around this room anymore, so everything should be drawn to the southwest, near the saw and the workbench, not here. Is that a dog? Oh yeah. Something's getting destroyed. I think maybe the one by the workbench. Uh, there's a couple of windows I barricaded, right? If I hear anything trying to get in, that's when I'll turn the light on and that's when I'll get my gun out. Because I know the jig's up then, you know? Is it wrong that I want a banshee to appear so I can just... Okay, that's close. I need to see which one that is. Okay. What is it? I think it's a dog. Fuck you. Oh my god. Nice, nice. Okay. Oh, you did actually move the wardrobe. I didn't think you could do that. Now what? Right, it's that one. Okay. No, for fuck's sake, I need to st I need to learn. It's because I don't play this game all that often. Oh fuck. Oh Jesus. Fuck you. Ow. <laughs> That'll keep him out. Oh my goodness, right. I'm going to take one of these. Yeah, because I've got that perk. Armor as well! Oh, I didn't know that actually came with it, but that's nice. That's cool. Right, do I... Rep I, could, I can't repair it, can I? No. That's fine. That's fine. J oh, you don't jump over it! Damn, I am... <laughs> My bloody axe needs repairing. Maybe I should turn the light off again. I don't want to, though. Not now. What happened to that guy? Did the dog kill him? It wasn't me. Maybe he was set on fire. I don't know. Right, come on. Two more hours. I should be able to do this. I can hear it. I can hear it building. I think I still hear something somewhere. Southwest? Near the workbench, maybe? Come on, not long to go. Just a few seconds, just a few seconds. Right? We made it. Okay, we made it to day 14. And we've got some reputation. Another 250 with the three. Good stuff. Okay, I think... 
I think I'll probably leave that there. I will probably rebarricade the window and I'll make the door up again. That wasn't destroyed or it wasn't even attacked, I don't think. Maybe I'll bring some gas cans down here. I don't really know. But I survived. That's, that's all that really matters. And I guess now we can cook some things. Cool. Yeah. All right. Okay, so let's see. Anything new with the three? I don't think they talk. Right. Much like I always do. Definitely want to get the small caliber magazine. The pistol's so damn good. Um, what would I need to repair the axe? Let's just have a little look at that. I think it's wooden nails, maybe? Oh, some scrap metal and the wood. Okay, well, I've got, I've got both, so I think that's worth doing. So there you go. What about upgrading it? Can I do that? I could, theoretically, but I don't have enough. Ooh. Really? <laughs> Rocks are actually used for something? That's not too difficult to come by. Although that's a big old waste of scrap metal. Hmm. Maybe I should get that, because only after, like, four or five swings, it's pretty much down and dead. I don't know. I'll have a think about this. I'll have a, uh, I'll have a big old think about this. Right, thank you very much for watching yet another day of Darkwood. I suppose next we'll go north, and we will bring the shovel this time. Hopefully dig up the compressor parts, fix the compressor, and, well, we'll see where we go from there. See you then. But I did manage to sell the fabric that I had. What was that? Wait, whoa, Jesus Christ! That could be one of the crates that needs a lockpick. Yeah, okay. I don't... Wait, really? Oh, that must be so... Oh, wait, I just realized that I have a fucking... Oh, god damn! What the fuck is... Oh, sorry, who the fuck is that? Is that... That's the doctor! He's actually got antlers now! Oh! That's a big one. Sure, sure. <laughs> really? What the hell's it? No! <laughs> Fuck you! That'll, <laughs> that'll keep him out!